She is doing very well. I gave her all fours and glows. Um, she works well with others. If she has to be in a group, she's she's not overpowering, but she's able to work well with um, the group that she's in, no matter who she's with. Hey guys, it is time for our last conference. Sunshine somehow got last. And as you know, she goes to tutoring. And so she's the one that I feel like the most urgent to check in with her teachers and see how she's doing. So let's go meet them. So how is she doing? She is doing very well. I gave her all fours and glows. That's her first time. Is it really? Oh. I had threes and I was like, you know what? No, I went back and changed that and then gave her all four. She does demonstrate motivation and responsibility. She's always very responsible in her getting her work turned in. I mean, she gets it completed on time. She works well with others. I mean, I have no problems as far as that goes. Math, I think, was all meets except for the one right here that I gave everybody an IP in because knowing their multiplication facts, I obviously don't expect them to have them all memorized right. by the first quarter. Yeah, it's a year-long goal. Year goal. Okay. So, you know, hopefully by the end of third grade, we will have those mastered. But okay. I mean, she's doing fine in math. She's got meets and everything else. Good. And also I have her for science, <laughs> pollution. She got a meets in pollution awesome. and heat energy and meets. Um, in reading, she is reading on a level P. Okay. Where we want them at the end of third grade is a level P. So oh. she's doing very oh my well. Gosh. She's Yay. doing very, very well. Okay. Um, she's able, if I were, were to give her a word that may be a make believe word, she's able to use those phonic skills and sound it out mm -hmm. and tell me what the word is. Yeah. Um, a lot of times, the ones that get IPs are the ones that they see the first two letters and they're like, oh, here's the word. Mm -hmm. And it's just a word they know. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So she's, she's doing really well with that. And I'm working on her being able to find words and sentences and using the context clues to figure out what does it mean. Mm -hmm. So she can tell me what the word is. Now we're working on what does it mean. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> Um, then she's able to read with fluency, uh, where we want them at right now is at 90 words per minute, mm -hmm. uh, 90 to 105. Okay. So she's in that range. Good. Um, apply a variety of strategies to understand and explain text. She does have an IP because she can understand it, but just putting it back into words sometimes is, is a little difficult for her. Yeah. Um, and is that writing it or is that... <clears throat> vocalizing it. Writing it. She okay. could tell us. I was going to say, she can verbal. Right. I'd be surprised if she struggled with that, but this is writing it back down is definitely and a challenge. one thing that could help, um, like a homework or things like that, is using like a dictation app. Mm -hmm. So she can speak it and then it would type it for her, so then she can see the placement of the words and stuff mm -hmm. like that. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> but her narrative writing, that's just writing a story, mm -hmm. beginning, middle, end. Mm -hmm. um, she's coming up with really good beginnings. All we're doing right now at the very beginning is coming up with one sentence to in explain or introduce the, the topic, and then at the end, using that same sentence and tweaking it just a little bit, but still using that sentence to keep our minds to where it starts and where it ends. Mm -hmm, <clears throat> mm -hmm. um, uh, acquire and use uh, precise words in academic uh, vocabulary. A lot of times she repeats herself. Um, she might say, then I did this, then I did this, then I did this. And what we're trying to work on right now is transition words. Mm -hmm. First I did this, then I did this, after that. Mm -hmm. And so we're working on those and also trying to bring in some vivid verbs. Instead of did, we're trying to vamp it up and try to make it a little more interesting. The oral communication, she has no, no problem vocalizing anything she needs to say. Um, she works well with others if she has to be in a group. She's, she's not overpowering, but she's able to work well with um, the group that she's in, no matter who she's with. Okay. Um, in social studies, we've done the topographical features, uh, latitude, longitude, prime meridian, uh, uh, equator. She did very well with that. And we've also covered the six uh, American Indians, and she's, uh, again, doing very well with that. So now, this quarter, we're doing uh, European explorers, which they haven't gotten that yet. We'll be, in, in another week, they'll come back and do social studies. So are you doing tests? Mm -hmm. or? Mm -hmm. And this is with tests. That's awesome. mm -hmm. Solving 
mm -hmm. um, problems involving time mm -hmm. exceeds. That means she got a hundred on it because I only gave exceeds to a few people if they got a hundred on the test because mm -hmm. it was a hard test because mm -hmm. mm -hmm. it had to do with elapsed time, telling time to the minute. Mm -hmm. So she oh, some um, adults got hundred. I know. <laughs> so to get an exceeds on that, that was really That's good. That's awesome. That's really good. That I'm so glad to hear that. And she's so funny. She came in and she said, "I do my math homework on." Monday or Tuesday, and it's all done. Mm -hmm. <laughs> or she does something. Quite proud of that. She, she that's pretty sick. good. Well, I mean, considering last year we spent all night every night on homework, mm -hmm. the fact that she can have a plan that she mm -hmm. set up mm -hmm. and she manages it, it's like and she likes awesome. to do it too. Yeah, yeah, yeah like, I love getting my homework done. I'm like. Nice. <laughs> 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 oh, good. I, love that. I know. <laughs> That's so yeah, awesome. she is definitely having a positive experience this year. Good. Good. Definitely. Good. Yes, thank you. Well, I put my camera on a desk and when I picked it up, it was dead. So I don't know how much of that you missed, but Sunshine's teachers had so many wonderful things to say about her. I can't wait to tell her how amazing she's doing and how proud I am of her. What'd you think, Dad? I'm very proud of her. They said she's a very hard worker and she helps out all the time, which I love, I love that she's a helper and I love that she's a hard worker because that's really what's important, right? Yep. You can do so much in life if you're a hard worker. Good job, sunshine.